Facts. Girls, girls, girls. That was a joint. Speaking of girls, 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 my man Umar got married to two of them. Give him Yo, a what? go to applause. Yo, I'm <laughs> not applause. Hold where's on. applause? Hold on, no, hold, hold on. on v. Give my man applause for his two black queens. Man, don't do don't do that like that. Yo. We we gonna applause him. Uh, he tried to, and I'm gonna add my own shit. Yo, <laughs> I just yeah, I mean, I just I, I don't know Umar. Like Umar, we, what are we, we up to? We support him. For, are we happy for the black? Are you happy for the black man? I mean, he, I'm the happy. Fuck, he got two joints. For one, I don't even understand. Me personally, I don't know why they go sign up for double the stress. You know what I'm saying? So you anti poly? I think it's double the stress. Okay. It's not just about the fucking. You gotta actually deal with both these bros. Yeah. We back. We at episode 83, Old Shintai Place, yeah. on the 13th of September. August just came and it fucking went. <laughs> For real. August? August been gone. September almost and gone. September damn near gone, right? You Shit, took, you took September a, 11th. You thought you could take a breather? Is niggas man? numb to September 11th? Does it, like, oh, does it affect shit. you? <laughs> nah. what? Nah. That's crazy, right? What? Is, are we numb to September 11th? I mean, I think. Are you numb to it personally? No, nah, I mean, I, I mean, I was up top, yeah. so I feel like it's damn impossible to be numb to it because there was like so much going on around it in niggas' youth, and it took up, took up so much of what the fuck we had going on at that time period. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? But am I like sitting around thinking about the fallen, the fallen um, soldiers or whatever, whoever died and all that, and the families and all that and all that? Nah, yeah. I'm not thinking. Of, I'm not too much thinking about. I ain't gonna lie. I spent more time this September 11th actually finding out that that um, under the World Trade Center was actually all just like African, African trading. Yeah, I didn't burial. know that. Shit, like they, burial, a lot of, it was like a lot of dead African, be, yeah, bodies because they wasn't allowed to be uh, buried in New York proper, so they had to be buried down there, and that's where they really sold a lot of slaves at and all that and all that back, back, back in the ri- early times. Early, early times, yeah, yeah that before shit is it was wild. illegal and all that up there. Has your perspective changed, like now that like with the internet and canon and like conspiracy theories as yeah, far as nine eleven? Yeah, it's like yo, Chamber Street, like yeah, you know I mean, like some that's really some black shit, you know what I mean? Yeah. You said you said so. Yeah, cause so it's hard. Do you, to, let me it's ask hard you, to really do you feel like a terrorist? Do you feel like it's? Do, do you still feel like Muhammad Atta was was like they just did that Taliban? Yeah, the, or the, the, per, like the, the perfectly was unburned passports, like yeah, you know I'm saying like I, it was just too convenient. They just found mad like mad documentation still, of who did it. Yeah. Like, first of all, it was like perfect documentation, I'm untouched, still, unscathed. They had lost me when I first started seeing the conspiracy shits, and they was like, well, jet fuel can't really burn steel beams. Like, it can't melt through it. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah. I don't like, you know, some, somebody blew something up. Then you hear news of more, there was several more explosions after the plane hit. Yes, and, yes. Uh, uh, and all these other things. So, yeah, I mean, it's hard to... It's just hard to have the same type of... At the end of the day, you still feel... I, you just feel sorry for the people... The innocent, the, the innocent the people innocent. that just were at work. That just was at and work. Died, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Or the people that came to save somebody and ended up inhaling wild fumes and end up dying two Yo, years the, later. The pulling up and to save other somebody people. and then, like... Yeah, like... It all, died is the worst. Yeah, all the people that, like, ended up with the diseases and all that that they ended up suing and getting... You know what I mean? Their families got money and all that, but that don't really bring nobody back. It don't nah. matter. I don't know. And then, yeah, bro, I can't, I can't see, I can't see it making. Nah, bro. The images are still wild, like. Yeah, planes, like I don't. It's so crazy, building, but and then building fall. The whole, the whole patriot shit though. It's like, yo, it's like you feel sorry for the people, but you don't feel the whole same. Like, yo, we gotta go. America, the great go America versus go fight whoever. somebody that yeah, did nah. that. Whoever did this to us, like it's mad. It's way more complicated it's than way me. More I mean, like who as far did, as I'm concerned, we did it to ourselves. Yeah, like who <laughs> did it? Like who yeah, did it? Who did it? I don't know who, who did, did it, it yet. I don't know who did that it. That shit is so confusing. I don't know who did it. I don't know who was a part of it. You know what I mean? Like I just feel like that's just out of, outside my pay grade, outside of my political grade. Like and I, that's like a rabbit hole. That's like really, really deep. You know what I yeah. mean? And then it's like, it'd be weird too. Like, you know, they, they say, like, it was the wild celebrity, like Michael Jackson, my favorite nigga. Like, he was supposed to have a mean, he overslept that day. You know what I mean? It was it's a just real a lot of. <laughs> yeah, it's too much coincidence for it's me. It's wild coincidence. It's wild coincidence. But being that it is 20th anniversary, 
Blueprint came out on 9-11. We got to give Blueprint. Whoa. Shout out to Blueprint. Can we get an applause for Blueprint? Let's give a Blueprint applause one time, man. Shout out to Hove, man. I'd say Blueprint is a top three. Top three Hove album. You know what I mean? Yeah. Hey, nigga came out on September 11th and still sold half a ticket. First came week. the same day as the Twitter. This is when niggas was doing physical copies. Like, so let's put some respect on Hove name. Where you put this album, Blueprint? Out of what? Out of Hove shits. Out of Hove albums? Yeah. It's second. Second. My yeah. reasonable. Yeah. Copy. Yeah, I, yeah I'm it's okay second. with second. It's easily second. I listen to it more than reasonable, though. That's the funny shit. You know what oh, I mean? Man. But I, I respect reasonable enough to say that I'll accept second. You know what I'm saying? It's definitely second. Fab, but it's absolutely fire. It's absolutely fire. But you, no skips. I mean, I be skipping eights to the Izzo because it was like a commercial joint. But, but that song is still fire. fire. There's that a lot of bars on there. It's a lot of bars. It's a lot of bars. It's a lot. You know what I mean? Like, and dude, it's crazy. 20 years went by so fast. It's like, damn. Yeah. I feel like that shit just came out. Not I just used, came out, but it was like a few years ago. I used that for my high school yearbook quote. My nigga. A drink from Blueprint. Which one? What, do you remember the quote? Um, as damn. Which? Uh, was it girls, I, girls, girls? Nah, nah, nah. It was uh, from, from the womb to the tomb. Uh, what, what, how it goes? Switch. Uh, I know what you're talking about. Drink, yeah. drink, drink army, army from one cup. That's the ritual. The room. That's the ritual. I, it was. It was I ain't from that song. It was one ball from and all the one, shit that we. Yeah, that was, was my shit. From, it was a ball from that shit, but I can't remember. I, I can't remember. Which one it was, but it was a ball from that shit. Or that might have been the ball I pulled. That was my shit. I don't know. I think all it's I need is my favorite sure. joint off there. My bucket is right. Yeah. My rocket way is feeling incredible. Check. <laughs> <laughs> you feel me? Nigga <laughs> said mama said I done killed the man. Swagger back. Mama that's, said that's I killed shit. the man. Well, I guess, guess I, got I got the, the dagger back. <laughs> the intro was rulers back is fire. Yeah. Girls, 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 one and two is fire. Um, no, yeah. ain't no love, Lil, never change, so all privacy, exercise. lyrical exercise. It's just top to bottom heat. Yeah, so it was just pretty ridiculous. It was crazy. I was listening to it over the weekend. It was like, it, just songs back then, like, it wasn't that far. It was songs it actually used to be like four minutes. Like, yeah. it, I was like, that shit's kind of long. Was, yeah. Some of these joints, yeah, you know I mean? Five, five, six minutes. Yeah, really, um, five. First, it said you said six minutes. I was in some R&B shit. They mandatory five minutes yeah. to R&B joints. They running on they that not, joint. They giving you breakdown. They like giving you They giving you a minute of just instrumental. Yeah. They're on the fade out. Like, <laughs> they using all of the, you know what I'm saying, all of yeah. the vinyl, B, for sure. Facts. For sure. Fact. Now they in two minutes, niggas is checking out. Yeah, like, it's, it's you, over, gave you bro. two verses, bro. Like, what do you want? Nah. Really, Hope. one verse. What's hot niggas? Just one more verse, right? Yeah. It's like, for all the, Hope I mean, giving you minimal three verses on all of that Hope was shit. giving you three Whole verses, yeah. like full songs and chorus. Take like, over, he wild up nines and um wild them niggas up. Is that top ten? You got that top ten disc? Of course. Okay. Nah, because I was talking to niggas. Niggas be trying front on take over. Like it's not How like can that. You? What? Like you know, he everybody wild just nines, prodigy, fat Joe. All Who else he wild on? Just those are the main three culprits that really got it the most. I nines feel like he wild on somebody else too. I just I don't remember. I think he might have been. It might have been like in the for the rest of y'all. Fuck y'all niggas. I yeah. only get half a bar. They might have got that. Yeah, one. half a bar of ass straight. niggas. Yeah, half, half a bar of ass niggas. niggas. The half a bar niggas got that straight. But it was definitely mob deep and Nas energy because y'all niggas was blown. Yeah, it was wilding. So we had yeah. to tighten y'all up. I personally yeah. like Takeover more than Ether, but you know, whatever. That's just that's like I guess that's just me. People say otherwise. New York voted otherwise. Niggas voted Ether. That shit was some bullshit. That shit was bullshit. I think that was just like an anti hope campaign. We answered a couple phone calls and we going to say New York, no, New, New York, York said. Voted, New York said Ether. We like, answered what? like five phone calls. We going to say New York said Ether. Fuck out of here. Yeah, nah, I wasn't going for that. That was some real shenanigans right that there. That was dumb shenanigans. I ain't like how they played that. He tried to front on my man Hov, had my nigga scrambling his Yo, get the fuck. Yeah, that was <laughs> that was crazy. I ain't gonna lie. Fab celebrated his 20 years since Ghetto Fabulous. It's so bad for him that he just happened to drop the same day as Hov yeah. and um and the Twin Towers. No funny shit. I bought both. Like I on, did too, because I was not, a fab nigga. I mean, yeah, nah, I mean, I can't remember if I made it to the store on the day the Twin Towers fell. I probably was like two days after though, but nah, I, bought, I wasn't. I, I don't think I wasn't on September 11th. Yeah, I wasn't. Purchase, I, yeah. I, I ain't do all that because there was a lot going on with the towels and all that. Yeah. But two days later, I was definitely at. Was it Best Buy or was it what was that shit? Was it the Wiz? Was you at the Wiz Tower City? Yeah, I think it might One have been at joints? the Wiz. I think it was at the Wiz. I remember me. the Wiz. It was yeah. right outside the Garden State Mall. I was at the Wiz. 
And I bought both them Tower shits. records. I, I, that I shit. had to beat my mom for a ride to the mall. Like, yo, I need these albums. Like, it's a serious thing. Like, was that the last al- physical album you bought? Nah, I think the last physical album I bought was, um, um, Stank On Ya, um, Stank On Ya, with the speak, nah, what was that? Was, um, Outcast. Outcast joint. That was after Speaker Box Love Below, right? Yeah. Nah, that was before that was it. Before. That was before it. Okay. I definitely didn't buy that shit. Oh, you skipped on that one? No, hold up. It might be. It might have been a speaker box love below there. Whatever one one that came out last. That might have been one of the last joints I bought physical. Okay. So it was an Outcast joint. They got your last brief. Nah, I mean, I you know I bought other nigga shit digital, so I guess that shit count. But I'm, I'm physical shit that over. you can touch. Yeah, like CD. yeah, yeah, yeah. I think I might even boot like boomerang my name, my nigga, for real. No, nah, I'm lying to you. I'm dead ass. Hold on. Now nah, the last album I bought physical, Hove joint might have been like black album. Yeah. Okay. I remember, I remember going, seeing nigga. I, I don't think I had. I might have had physical black album. I remember that going to the it. store and buying black album when they first released it, when they had the all black cover with no no nothing on it. It was yeah. all black. The whole case was black. My favorite physical is, to this day is still Immunity. It was just red and blue disc. <laughs> <laughs> Immunity was fire. It was a fire. I remember. I it's certain joints I remember purchasing. I remember purchasing Marshall Mathers LP too. I was on a school trip. And I just remember playing that shit on the way back. I'm like, that shit's all right for white boy. Nah, but yeah, what? <laughs> I mean, that shit was fire since that the first fire. the first album was fire. That shit was fire. Okay, yeah, we got some shit with you. Facts. Girls, girls, girls. That was a joint. Speaking of girls, 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 my man Umar got married to two of them. Give him Yo, a what? go to applause. Yo, I'm <laughs> nah, not a pl- hold where's on. applause. Hold on, applause. Hold on, no, hold, hold on. on. V. Give my man applause for his two black queens. Man, don't do don't do that like that. Yo. We we gonna applause him. Uh, he tried to, and I'ma add my own shit. <laughs> Yo, I just, yeah, you know I mean, I just, I, I don't know Umar. Like Umar, we, what are we, you we, up to? We support him. For, are we happy for the black? Are you happy for the black man? I mean, he, I'm the happy. Fuck, he got two joints. For one, I don't even understand. Me personally, I don't know why they go sign up for double the stress. You know what I'm saying? So you anti poly? I think it's double the stress. Okay. It's not just about the fucking. You gotta actually deal with both these bros. Yeah, but what if it's I, see? But this a thing though. Like you got, you know how you dealt with certain joints, and they just can been completely under your thumb. Like do whatever you tell you. So imagine you got two of those. <laughs> <laughs> That's on time, man. Like yeah, but they, I mean, they all up. they still gonna still, stir the pie. They still, still, still gonna stress. stir the pie. The jo- a joint that said, like you said, the, the, to use your terms, under the thumb. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just saying, like, you feel me? It's the joint. That that joint is very, very emotionally invested in you, so she's going to have mad episodes if it's... uh, She's going to be, you know what I mean, upset at different shit a lot. That's why I I just want to know, like... If like if you clap in one right, it's like regular shit, y'all in the living room, right? Because everybody live together. And then like the one walks in, does she like does it hit her chest a little bit, or does she be like, oh, nah, I gotta I don't join think, in? I don't think they care. I don't think. But yeah, once you sign up to get married together, I don't think they care no more. But I think they might fuck around and have days like yo, you, you only clap day. my shit on this day. Or, I don't know who knows. Maybe it's man orgies. Maybe they like each other. They all yo, like each other. Who knows? I, I, yeah, I was remember I was watching this, the Joe Exotic. Remember his documentary. And one of the zookeeper niggas, he had six joints, like, yeah. and they all lived on campus with him. You know what I mean? Yeah. But they just had designated houses. You know what I'm saying? So I uh, think with his situation, I don't think he was like trying to keep them all extra together, like they working together. But like he just go to a different house whenever he wants a certain type of box. But I'm but hold on, that. B. like back to Umar, back to Umar. B. Like, I, does this hurt his credibility with his whole with what he's trying to get off? Nah, cause he's promo- listen, like. All right, if we know niggas are Africans before white European Christian ideology came and whitewashed all of us, you know what I'm saying? Like, polygamy wasn't like, that was like normal, that was a normal practice. This still is in a lot of countries in Africa, you know what I'm saying? Don't roll your eyes, you know what I mean? I, mean, like, I don't know. You know I don't mean? know none of these things. Bro. I just, I right, from, I can tell you, Mansa Musa, kings of Africa, for they had hundreds of wives. If your brick was up, you had more than one wife. Yeah. And I understand the structure, like, all right, let's look past the right, you get multiple boxes. And let's just look at it, like, because that's great. But let's just let's just analyze it just from a, a foundation and building, like, a structure and being successful. Like, you got X, more income, more breach, yeah. right? More breach, 
more brain power. You know what I mean? What she yeah. might not, she might not know. She might. I mean, it's, it's just because people know different shit. So let's yeah. just say more brain power. Yeah. More breach, more brain power. That too, right there, is cool. So that, but that, but that's, but that comes with assuming that you that you haven't that you picking small wives. I mean, that's I would. A, I mean, at this big age, and yeah. I think between Umar, like I'm sure he's picking people that have some type of intellect. You know what I mean? Like this competent in the real world for the most part. I don't think he's picking retards. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Like. I'm, I mean, uh, I, on, man. I, Umar like he getting away with some shit, B. I don't. Just just, let's say this. I don't know if they was dimes as far as physical, but like they seem like they, they wasn't horrible nice looking. They wasn't horrible. They wasn't horrible looking. As I said, mean like nice middle aged joints. Yeah, they're good, regular, whatever. Umar is smarter. Like, all right, you a smart nigga. Sometimes, like when you t- talking to somebody who you know is like intellectually lower than you, like that gets annoying. Like. Umar is very well spoken. Niggas can say what they want about the school and all that shit. He's eloquent. He know how to articulate himself. Yeah. I say that to say, I don't think Umar would sign up to be made with two dumb, super idiotic broads who's not like they nah, might not I be on the same level as them intellectually, but they on the way up. And they I probably, don't, yeah, I don't think they're necessarily stupid. I'm just, I'm just starting to feel like Umar's starting to give me like some West Bengali coat vibes. Like you over here now, you fucking the followers and you marrying yeah, a couple. Just, just grabbed, and just, and uh, I was getting a little I mean, crazy, Umar. Like, I think, I right, look, let's call it spade a spade, like. He he's on a gram. He got some type of celebrity. Like I'm pretty sure, like they were probably some followers. Like yeah. they probably came to a few book signings or whatever. Yeah. He's like, all right, it's your third time here. Let's figure it out. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like you didn't came to three. Just, like if you cut to three, if I move up, I see a bitch cut to three of my shit. It's like, all right, you feeling me? Like what's yeah, up? Bro? Like, 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 like you come to you yeah, traveling to I'm the inspiring book signing. You, you, you know, I'm inspiring you. But like, he's supposed to be inspirational. He ain't supposed to be trying to put his cock in joints. He got a nut too. Yeah, like, he, he, yeah, but boss. he ain't really supposed to. He ain't really supposed to be. You not supposed to in his motherfucking constituencies per se. You know what I mean, for what he trying to do, it seem like he kind of. I don't know, son. It sound good, but like, listen, like I know niggas that's like that teach grad school. Like and they be like I've talked to older niggas they be like yo I, I, listen be it be hard not to hit the grad students yeah like, it's one thing when you teaching them yeah, undergrad because they still kind of young but once they get the grad and they grown and they still yeah. want it and like yeah. they obviously respect your intellect because you yeah. teaching them yeah. it's like why well, I'm not gonna take it you yeah. know what I mean like rappers fuck groupies who my fucking his followers what are you gonna do yeah yeah I mean man. it's 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 not supposed to happen but it's like it's good it's, I it's, just feel like it, it might hurt the credibility of what you're trying to get across if niggas know you clapping could. clapping your constituency it, huh? obviously it would. Be a way better look if Umar had maybe like a joint that just been on deck since like day one, like yeah. a day one joint. Like that would be a way better look. I, clearly, I agree with you. And it does kind of look shaky, but it's like, can you blame him? <laughs> like, 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 you gotta take advantage of the fans at some point. Like, what the fuck? As long as everybody's crystal clear about what's going on, I'm not knocking Umar. Be like, all Umar get is slander from half the black community, which I don't like. Nah, you know yeah, that's that's another thing. Like, I, me personally, I fuck with Umar, okay. so I don't want him to get bad looks. And now it's more reasons for other motherfuckers to be talking shit about Umar. Well, black you know Christians was up in arms, but you know, it's funny that as. People, as we evolve and as time passes, like, you know, just, just looking at the comments, I think overall people are starting to see, like, you know, like, we're not going to judge niggas because they don't, if they want to practice polygamy, because like I said, like, a lot of people realize that wasn't a foreign practice for a lot of our old, our ancestors coming from Africa. Like, niggas had more than one wife. Even in the Muslim, even now, like, in the Muslim religion, like, having more than one wife is, is a regular practice yeah, as long as you can take care of it. You know what yeah. I mean? Like... Yeah. It's, and I know niggas like I got niggas that's strict Muslim and will have multiple bitches and be like, this is what it is. Like, yeah. I'm I'm still under the Islam. I'm still following the rules. That's why. You know crazy. what I'm saying? So it's like, yeah. You feel me? Yeah. So I can't really. You know what I'm saying I'm not going. I'm not. I'm happy for Umar. You know what I mean, I'm happy he got black queens. I'm unhappy that there are black people that are trying to ridicule him for practicing polygamy. Like that's what was really bothering me. And then like. People are like, oh, where's the school at? Like, school's coming, my nigga. Like, the fuck? Be like, my yeah, man, be happy. You, you spending money on a wedding and shit. Like, what's up with the school? Don't say you spending money, bro, because we're going to be respectful to Umar. Like, the shit looked like it was in the garage. <laughs> <laughs> like, it was like it was, it looked like it was at my local rec center. Like, and like, I think I 
looked at the address and was like, like a boys and girls. Club. Yo, yeah, how you get the address to Umar's Because he posted man. it. Like, yo, what? He posted like, yo, pull up. I mean, yo. If you want to say, you tell you to pull up. Like, <laughs> niggas pulled up. That's crazy. What you told me? What did you say? Umar's a man of the people? He is That's a man. what Umar's you, a man you said. Of the that like twice today. Umar's a man of the people. And I went he on his page he and he had that bullet. shit up. Address was like, <laughs> pull up for the boys and girls <laughs> for the union. So he let niggas know, like, that's why I fuck with Umar. Like, if a nigga gonna give out his public addy, the addy to the public for the wedding, like, yeah. I ain't knocking it. Be like, well, how much more transparency I'm you I'm marrying want? both my joints. I'm marrying both my joints. You can show up. Some niggas show up. I feel like he should have been told us that he was on time. And like, why do you ain't been told when you had two joints, Umar? Like, why you just pop up married with two joints, B? I feel like you feel duped. I mean, but see, that's I, the like, thing, though. So, not OD, but you, because I, I feel like he was on his king vibes anyway. But like, that's what I'm saying. Like, I, I wasn't shocked. Like, I, I feel like that's all. That's some shit. I feel like, <laughs> I, like me personally, I feel like that's all. It was a tad bit. It was, it was all brand. I feel like that's all brand. It was all brand, but it, the fact that it was randomly married, like yo, where did it was it come dumb from? random. It was where dumb random. From? It was dumb random. Like, and it, and, and, and it's two sides to the coin. It's like it's like I it's like now like. You might got a joint you dealing with. Like, are you necessarily going grand with it? Like, are you t- keeping niggas up to date? Like, yeah. what, what the status is? Like, yeah. you might just pop up one day like, yeah, I'm engaged. Like, yeah, you know I'm saying? You might but not tell pop niggas. Up, pop up, marry, pop up, marriage is ceremony a lot. and all that. With and no you, engagement. And you yeah, being yeah. a public eye. That's what made me feel like even more that they was his followers. Like, yo, these joints is definitely his followers. I guarantee you Umar didn't get on bending knee. <laughs> like, yo, <laughs> you and you. I'm, I'm sure Umar was like, listen, yeah, this is what we doing. <laughs> like, yeah, like, they probably, they probably pregnant. Yeah, they're like, pregnant uh, by now. Uh, yeah, yeah, I, yeah, y'all gotta have my. Let me make y'all honest by now. Let me make y'all honest. Let me make y'all honest. Women's be. Y'all marry me. We gonna do our. Yeah, you know I mean, king me, polygamy, polygamy, all Umar, of that. The God, say, African king, pan African king. Like this is what it is. But see that. He, see now he making his shit look more nuts. He calling himself prince of pan Africanism and all that wild shit. Now you marrying. Now you marrying two, three bitches out your constituency. Now it's like you starting to get ridiculous with your shit. Like you, you, you really I see how you your say it. Like when you marry the fathers, it kind of comes across cultish. It's like yeah, like, now, where now you, like, where, where you going with it? Is this you some said. brother polite shit? Like what are you doing? Yeah, man? where you? Yeah, it definitely could come across like that for sure. But for me, I'm happy for the nigga. You I mean, yeah, man? go get your. I mean, have fun, Umar. Fuck it. You know what I mean, but me, per- if I was thinking of my brand, I wouldn't do that one. But fuck it, Umar. Live your life. Cook yeah. up. Yeah, yeah. It, it, it. Don't, Fuck it. I don't want to hear a fucking brother polite or Africa Bambada type story out of this nigga. Oh some, please, like, please, please. Yeah, I, yeah. Hopefully, I just, hope, I just want right. Umar. To, I don't need no like predatory shit with Umar. Don't, please. don't. That, like, he was that locking the bitches in the basement. <laughs> yeah, even some, some, we don't some, need no kind of weird. He married with some shit. He been grooming been his constituency 16, for ten years. Yeah, like some like, whack shit. All type of. Other like I said, shit. I looked down. They, they look like they're his age. Yeah, but they don't look like they like thirty. Like they look like they like forty three or something. You know what I mean? So like, hopefully, hopefully, like like I said, like hopefully everything's on. Board, everything's on board. Everything. Things on the up and up. Everything, yeah. What else is going on, man? It's fashion week. Yo, Shit crazy. Yeah, these niggas is out of pocket. Everybody cousin, is wearing anything. Your cousin, first of all, that's a lot. It's a lot of fashion. We weren't gonna your cousin Westbrook. He went full on dress, first of all. Like, and blue hair. He went blue hair. And icy mint blue hair. Larry Johnson, who's, who's starting to become one of my favorite pages on IG, said the rituals have started. <laughs> the satanic rituals have started. The ritual season has His begun. The ritual season has begun. Lil Nas X want to fucking, what's some call it? Uh, all right, so yeah, they, they, they are going to push Lil Nas X to the forefront. Like, yeah. it no matter what. And it's yeah. just like, I'm not anti-gay. I just don't like the argument that people are like, if you don't agree with the lifestyle, it's just, it's just automatically homophobic. Like, that word gets thrown around egregiously way too much. Like, it's just too much. Like it, I don't like I don't have to. I don't have to. I'm not gonna have nothing against gay gay shit, gay gayness or whatever it may be. But why do I gotta see here and look at man nipple and all type of you, other? You know what? I, you know what I'm gonna say? How about this? Like I'm gonna go this route. Like. Niggas is not aesthetically pleasing to look at, right? Like, they, I, we're not beautiful creatures like women are. So, I don't want to see a bunch of niggas yeah. <laughs> all the time. Like, niggas. I don't want to... Nas was up there when his, with, with a fucking thong underwear on, with his feet out. Like, oh, I don't want to see no so skinny weird. nigga running around my screen. Like, you not pretty, bro. That's like, weird. you not beautiful to look at. It ain't nothing to do with the yeah. gay shit. Like, it's just not... That's why I said, like, Prince was far from great. When he had his cheeks out, that shit turned me <laughs> off. I was like, I'm good on Prince. Like, he's 
doing too much. Like, yeah. I don't, I'm not feeling that. Like, <laughs> that shit, and I was a little kid feeling like that. Like, yeah, I don't like that I, shit. Yeah, bro. I'm cool. She was like, weird. She was weird to me. Like, you know what I mean? Like, I'm over here with Michael and them niggas. Like, yeah, he's light skinned, but he's still like keeping it thorough. Yeah, he's keeping his ass inside his yeah, pants. Yeah, he's keeping his ass in his pants. Yeah. Like, I don't want to see your cheeks, I'm bro. Going, I'm always for the nigga that's keeping his ass in his like, pants. Like, come bro. on, bro. I'm like, at least wear some pants. Like, niggas like, just out wear here, some pants. Niggas bro. out here wearing gowns, bro. Like, uh, like, what, you know what's crazy with Westbrook though? Like, he's so outlandish with his fashion that like I feel like the dress is like tame compared to some of the other shit. Like, no. don't forget he went no, he went stomach out. Like that's the crazy. The top was crazy. But, yeah, the whole top was the that's what's top like was crazy. that was crazy, bro. And the I feel Holter like he's done that like three times. Like I feel like that's not like a one stop shot. I feel like some I feel like he always goes hold the top playoff. These some niggas give you stomach out. These some these niggas Yo, give you that. Westbrook goes stomach out. <laughs> Every yeah. time the playoffs He's come. egregious, bro. Like, as soon as the weather break, nigga he goes went, stomach Nigga out. went icy blue hair and a gown. And, and was dragging his, like, dragging his mink. Like, yeah, like, <laughs> like I'm like him. Like, it's flea. Yeah, I, <laughs> like, it's flea. Like, it was Tom you make Brown. a nigga not even want to wear Tom Brown, because this then, is, like, then, like yeah, I ain't gonna lie. When I go on the Tom Brown website, like, I scroll through all of the books. Like, they got a lot of flagrant shit on their site. Oh, it's of mad of gay now? I'm not gonna say it's gay. Like, we're, we're gonna be, like... It's not for me. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Like, it's a lot of gowns and shit. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Like, I go right to sweatshirt. Yeah. Like, this that's what I want from y'all. Like, I don't need nothing. Whatever y'all are trying to do on the other side is cool. I just want you I like y'all sweatsuits. They comfortable. I like how they sit. You know what I mean? And they cloudy. Like, bitches see the little four bars. They're like, oh, you got a couple of dollars. Like, it looks like something. <laughs> you know what I mean? I'm just going to call a spade a spade. You only get fresh to see. You get fresh for yourself, but at this age, you put this on. You want bitches to see it. So yeah. I, that's why I like Tom Brown. It's just cloudy. You got the four bars, and it's comfortable. But he does a lot of extra shit with the, you know what I mean, that I'm yeah. not getting into. And the shit Russell had, had on was some of the extra shit, and it's just a little too much. But like I said, he went hold to top. So that was not like, that was that was it for me. I'm like, all right, he's over there. Like, and yeah. certain niggas I put into the basket that it's just like, they just going to be left. Russell Westbrook and Young Thug is two of them niggas. Like, I've yeah. accepted Thug's going to be whatever he's going to wear, whatever he's feeling at the moment, he's yeah. going to go left. Facts. Cool. And same with West. I don't really, like, I don't even get into the agenda shit with them niggas. I just feel like they just feel like they can push the envelope, and that's what they trying to do. Well, I don't, what, are, what, what are they achieving from pushing the envelope? Though? I mean, for Thug, it's just sales. Like, if you're an artist, anytime your name can get in the butt, like, because you got to think, like, Thug went raiding dress, whatever on the cover. Like, if you just uh, uh, some, I'm pretty sure if a thousand people seen that cover, a hundred people might have streamed the album just to see, like, all right, what was he about? Like, you know what I'm saying? Because well, you're well, just curious. So what is it? What's the motivation or if for you're us? Gay. So what's the motivation for us? What's the motivation for or what, Kid he's Cudi? Just, he's just a fashion. Kid Cudi still he does music, so but he he don't even drop like that for me to even say that. So I don't know. I think I always thought Kid Cudi was gay. Though. I'm just waiting for him to come out. Like, yeah. You know he's I mean? gonna definitely tell us that he sucked some dick before. Yeah, soon. like him and Frank. I knew Frank Ocean was gay, and I always thought Kid Cudi was kind of gay too. So I, I'm just waiting for him to come out and be like, my yeah, son went gown and, and fingernail polish. Yeah, like, all right, where you going? You know what I mean, and him and Yachty be doing tone painting, they toenails, yeah, all kind of wax shit. Like, yeah, like, hey, come I on. I think Cudi might have had nails on, like press on nails. See, that's where you start to lose me. And like, I've been lost, man. It's getting too crazy, V. I've been lost. It's, because it's like I said, like, Russ and Thug, they get left, but it's still certain niggas who I feel like it's... Th- Conway put on a, a kilt, too. Niggas wasn't feeling that. Niggas was, like, uh, really upset. Out of pocket. I don't know what he was doing. I don't know what and, that was about. See, was, that his, was that his ritual? <laughs> you know what I mean? Niggas was like, yo, fuck it, I'll do it, too, B. Like, they put me on, B. Like, like what was that it, about? Isn't he signed to, like, Eminem or Rock Nation Slim Shady. Or they definitely signed he to signed Slim to something big. They, signed they, they signed, signed to a big. major. They signed up, yeah. which is really Interscope. We signed to Shady, you signed to Interscope, which yeah. is Jimmy IV, which is yeah. under Universal. Which is which is, under, is weird dress. Which is, which is weird dress. Which is weird dress. <laughs> like, if you're under Universal, they're going to try to figure out how they can squeeze you. Yeah. <laughs> so, that was crazy. Like, Conway, I'm like, damn, bro. Like That was real. He just, was threw, really that no reason he just for threw that in there like he didn't do it. He just yeah, threw like, he just there. threw that in there. Like, what was the yeah. point of that? <laughs> like, that was crazy, like... I would have expected a nigga like Gun to go fashion skirt before the Conway. Yo, like I didn't even know where that came from. I don't even know who sent that through. I'm like, yo, how did this even happen? Like, it, and it's still lingering because like I be on it. Like I'll check in like with they. He just dropped the video. Niggas in the comments like I still ain't forget the dress, bro. Like, <laughs> you have explained it. You have to, you like, have you to, to explain, explain that. that. You just did it. You just did this shit. Put it on the internet and you didn't, you tell, didn't the- tell niggas <laughs> what it was about. Like what the fuck is going on, b? Like shit is crazy. Yeah. <laughs>
Like you just went dressed nah, like Nigga the explanation boy Like yo What I the I need that explanation bro What's that you know? Niggas is wearing dresses More than bitches these days It feel like Like Cause now I think about like When's the last time You went on a date with a bitch And she just had on a dress <laughs> like like I get like a flowy joint, like a flowy joint. Uh yeah. Uh, Are those like even in style? It's been a month. Of, it been like earlier this summer. A bitch had on a flowy. Yeah, a flowy joint. Yeah, okay. fact. So uh, let me ask you this: If a bitch pulls up on you in a flowy joint, do you feel like you can? I right, is she? Do you feel like she's styling, or do you look at her like, all right, this is something light, like? She's out the loop Like she in the loop do I mean, you, Does that make you feel like I, I gotta get dipped As opposed to the bitch Who might pull in a bodysuit With the white toenails You know what I'm saying With the Dior With the Bottegas on You it, know what I mean Yeah I mean If she slide through In some free flowing You know what I mean Going through wind shit I be I'm a I'm a I'm a like it Cause I like that type of shit But I'm not necessarily Gonna think she's fly you know yeah. what I'm saying? I'ma just think like if she got if she got a body, I'ma just be like, oh, I'ma like it. You know what I mean? Cause yeah. that, that should be looking good with body. And I'ma yeah. think like, oh, she want me to get right with her shit. She want she wanna get me, let me, you know what I mean, get crazy with it real easily. I like I like the flowy joint. I can just yeah. get right up under it. Yeah. So it's like, all right, you know what I mean? It's popping. I'm like, oh, it's lit. That's an easy, it's gonna be a great day. It's gonna be all right. It's gonna be fun. You know what I'm saying? But I'm not gonna think that she's fly though. You know what I'm saying? Nah, I can't really You're not nah. going for that? Copy nah. Copy, copy It's not a real Like, it's not a, That don't register as a Like a fit to me Like So what what What's a, what's, a, what's a fly girl fit In this age? Like, what's what's the standards? I don't know all this shit I don't know what they called And all that I ain't gonna lie But you know The shit the bitches wear The tight shit The shit, the little skirts Yeah, you know I mean, I'm I feel like They definitely getting away With a lot of fashion over though you know what I mean? Yeah, I mean, because I, I, I don't know the difference in the design. I don't know, and I don't really care either. Yeah. Like, as long as it sit right, I'm cool. Yeah. I, could, I feel like I can tell a cheap shoe. Yeah, I, can, I feel like I can tell a cheap shoe. <laughs> you know yeah. what I'm saying? But a bad shoe be blowing me too. Like, bitch, yeah. come on, man. Like, you, I got you get away with the $10 bodysuit. Like, you could have gave me a good shoe. Like, yeah. don't cut. Or, like, yeah, like, yeah. At least the nails, please be done. Like, I'm not asking for a lot. You know what I mean? <laughs> like, geez, Louise. But I, yeah. I'm a, I'm a, I'll be more so. I'll be more so worried about like just the upkeep, like yo, the hair and the and the face. Yeah. You know what I mean? And then I might look at the back of your ankle, like is it moisturized? Like or what? Bitch? Are yeah, you with like, ashy? Are you I need you to be wild, smooth, wild moisturized. Please be moisturized. Yeah, you know I mean, Please like be moisturized. All that I ain't been to the wax lady vibe. Like that's crazy. Nobody wants to hear that shit. You're a grown what? adult, bro. You know what I mean? Cause that is you better crazy. believe a bitch will grind you. Nigga go a couple a week or two no cut. Bitch is like, hold on now, like what's up? You know what yeah, I mean? I so we expect it. the same. I can't get with that type of work, B. I really want you to get laser, but I mean, whatever. I settle for wax. <laughs> <laughs> you know what nah, I mean? my first ex had laser. That shit just was extra smooth. Yeah, like, that I, shit I prefer just, a bitch I was to like, have laser. Like, and it just not, never came back. Yeah. Like it was just baby smooth for yeah. that was it. Pretty elite. Yeah. I'm, we advocate for laser on world stuff, man. Laser <laughs> it up, man. Fuck is y'all niggas talking about? What else happened? VMAs happened too, man. Psh, that shit is just getting more and more outlandish. It's just hard. To, it's hard to even want to keep Justin up. Justin Bieber won Artist of the Year. If that's, I guess that's the most important award. Beebs is the shit, son. I'm fucking with Beebs. Olivia Rodrigo won Best New Artist. Who fuck I can't is believe that? they they nominated Sweetie for that shit. Like she Polo G got, got jerks. Hits. Yeah, she do got hits. Little Nas X got uh, Montero video of the year. Fucking creep. The shit with the devil all through it. When yeah, was, the devil. Putting his shit. dick in the devil and all yes, that. Yes, of course. That's brazy. Yes, yes. Doja Cat was she hosting it? Cause yeah, yeah, I think she was hosting. She had all types of looks and shit. She looked. Oh, she did man, thing. that bitch. Little Nas won Wild Awards. He won Best Direction, Best Visual Effects. That nigga thanked the gay agenda. That was wild crazy. Travis Scott and Young Thug and MIA got best hip hop video for franchise. I don't even know. What I don't even know what the is. fuck that was. I missed that one. How the fuck can niggas have the best hip hop video or some shit that niggas never heard of? This VMA is not hitting the same way. So these niggas be getting away with murder, bro. They be calling anything rap. Niggas never even heard of that. Niggas never heard of that song. Like got MIA on it. Like cut the shit, bro. Who the fuck niggas... is MIA? The fly like paper get high like yeah, planes, right? Wow. I, I didn't know she was still around. John Fat Joe got a versus and now you tuning in? Um, I might. You know what? At first I was like, I, I'm if, I don't really got shit else to do. So I might tune in. At first I was like impossible. But yeah. I don't think I'm I mean I might not have the busiest night. I might say fuck it. 
Yeah, I'm, I'm going to tap in. I mean, Ja got a lot of hits. I, I wanted Ja to go against 50, which I knew that wasn't going to happen, but yeah. that's what I would... You know what I mean? I would have definitely been anticipating that. Ja just made, has made so many missteps since his height that... You just think of him in such a corny in way. In such a corny way. When you know he really got a lot of heat. He got a lot of heat. You he got a lot of heat. So I had to really think about it. I'm like, yo, he really might smoke Fat Joe boots, but Fat Joe got way more hard shit, though. Well, Fat Joe got some shit, too. Fat, Fat Joe, Joe was, like, good for a single, shit. like, for, like, at one single a year for, yeah. like, every summer. Fat Joe got a lot of hard shit. I'm sure Remy gonna pull up. Yeah, when if it's for the... But if, if Ja Rule keep it for the tree, she gonna she can smoke Fat Joe boots. Fat, I mean, Ja Rule have a Shanti pull up. Irv Gotti pull up. Yeah. You know what I mean? Give you a good Murder Inc., couple Murder Inc. joints. Yeah. You Facts. know what I'm saying? Facts. Like, Facts. We gonna see. Hey, I'm on. It's, it's, it's Tuesday. Part of it is tomorrow. So it's an error. You know what I mean? Yeah, it is. It was an error. error. I'm not gonna front on Ja because he got heat. You know what I mean? Like you said, like he just had so many missteps that like niggas just kind of look at him in a cornball way. Yeah. But uh, we're not gonna take away from 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 what he put out there. You know Fat I mean? Joe he, kind of holding himself out right now. He's like, fuck it, I'm hot right now. Yeah, he hot. You know what I mean? <laughs> he, he, was, he just got hot off a of sale like yesterday's price. You know what I mean? He's just yeah. running with it. I ain't mad at him. You gotta take advantage of this shit. Yeah. And he Time you catch a little flame, you definitely gotta ride that shit. That's crazy. But yeah, we gotta uh pay some bills. We'll be back. You know what I mean? Highlight the advertisers. Beep beep. Yeah. You know we gotta talk a little sports for the sports heathens. Football oh, is back. NFL is like we here. Roger Goodell said, you know what I mean? COVID or not, vaccines or not, and we getting the season started, man. Fuck it, B. Stadium is full as hell. It's full of shit. Full niggas of is shit. back. <laughs> niggas is in the stadium capacity. They niggas got niggas. Later game capacity. Facts. They got niggas clearly with no masks in the stands. Fuck it. They on time and they outside. Can we talk about the game of the week real fast involving my Cowboys? In the Buccaneers this past Thursday. You feel like that was the game of the week? Yeah, that's the best game I've seen. I was between that and the Cleveland and Kansas City shit. Yeah, that you was pretty I mean? good. But I just think with the star power, you had Tom, you had Dak, it's the Cowboys, it's, it's Jerry Jones, you know what I mean? It's, that's the game of the week. Okay. It's A.B. It's a lot. It's, the niggas was there. You know what I'm saying? And my Cowboys looked fucking great. The fuck is y'all talking about? We lost by two points to Tom Brady and them niggas. You know what I mean? I mean, at the end of the day, we got an incompetent kicker. He missed two field goals. We make the field goals, we win. You know what I mean? Because we only lost by two. He missed a three, three, uh, three yarder, uh, thirty yarder for three points, and he missed the extra point joint. Like, we can't we can't it's have pretty, that? It's pretty disgusting. It's really disgusting. Dak, fresh off shoulder injury and ankle surgery, threw for a four piece. You know what I mean? Four yeah. touchdowns. You let it know Dak, he's still airing. Dak definitely impressed me. He showed. Definitely impressed me, but they lost at the end of the day. Yeah, they you know did lose. I mean, you can't give the ball. They scored too fast. You are can't they, get a ball back to time. Are they last in the division? Who, who else lost? I think Washington lost too. Did Washington lose? Let me see. Let's check that. I got the. I got the. You know, I got that right did, here for you. The God fits man. Yeah, they did. Right. They lost to the Chargers. They definitely lost to the Chargers. I mean, I like. I mean, Eagles spanked the Falcons. The Falcons ain't shit. Niggas is telling me the they call them for Matt Ryan's head. Matt Ryan is terrible, Sean. Matt Ryan is really, really bad. And it's so sad that they didn't draft the quarterback all because that all because he's fucking the, the, the owner's daughter. <laughs> I, see, I didn't realize that. The owner's daughter's his wife. Oh, so, so I, I don't know how I missed that. It's one. The only, I mean, like, it's the only reason why they not, but they haven't drafted a quarterback. Oh yeah, that says it all. <laughs> that, that, Matt Ryan is going to get another five to ten from the Falcons. Now that you, now that you said nah, that, he's really got to get out of here, B. It's gotta I didn't know, know he was made all the all the blanks C, right? Yeah, his daughter. Yeah, I did not know that. Yeah, I don't know, but that's hard, be you go, it's hard to pack up your son-in-law, ain't it? I'm, he should retire. Like he's he's a done deal, bro. He's cooked. Yeah, he's definitely cooked. Like he's like he don't got no arm no more, son. He don't got no like, arm. Shit. He's old. I don't even think the team has confidence in the nigga anymore. Yeah, like, they're you know, like man right, running. Bro. They got a nigga that returned kicks as they main running back. You seen Julio on one out there? He pulled right up to Tennessee, and them niggas got smacked. And they up. got smacked. He didn't do nothing at all. And they they got smacked. They got smacked. Yeah, I mean, I don't know. Tennessee, I don't think they're gonna I think they're gonna take a step back this year. Even I though thought they got they actually gonna be good this year, but geez, that was that was scary. They got raped. Yeah, they got the truth. Kyle is the truth though. I told these niggas he's better than Lamar Jackson, bro. 
Kyle's yeah. the fucking he got a, He can do what Lamar do with a better ratchet. Yeah. You know what I mean? That's what it is. <laughs> Him and DeAndre got a year under their belt. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. The rapport. Yeah. Nah, I... The NFC West in general is, they, is serious. They got a way. They offense is focused on throwing that shit. You know yeah. what I'm saying? The mall should have focused on some weird shit. Like, oh, we, and he not still don't got no real right receivers. Like, they down to their fourth running back. I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> now okay. that you said, you were saying the Ravens might not make the playoffs. I didn't say might not. I said they're not. Oh, gonna you said they the aren't going to make it. Oh, you, you're confirmed. You're standing by. I said they was not making the playoffs. That was before all the injuries. Yeah, okay. And yeah. now the only now, injuries, now with they, injuries, they definitely, definitely not shaky. making the playoffs. Yeah, it's definitely shaky. Like, I didn't realize that they was down bad. Like, that so yeah. it's definitely shaky for them niggas. Like it's over, yeah. You know I mean, it's quiet. But I was saying about the NFC West, I feel like they might be the best division of football. Yeah, they it's got the Rams, possible. they got the 49ers. Rams 49ers. showed up last night. They did their thing. Yeah, I mean Matt Staff, out, Matt Staff with Sean McVay. You know what I mean, gonna, gonna I think right. is Andy Dalton finished because Justin yeah, Fields bro. got on the field. Yo, <laughs> and, yo, yo, yo. Andy Dalton looked like Dalton yo. Finished? What? Andy Dalton looks like a shell of himself, bro. He was never like that though. He was, was never a lot the of greatest. Green. He was never the greatest nigga ever. But he, he wasn't. Was, he was. He, he was serviceable. Did. He was serviceable. He, he could get it down the field. He could. I mean, he could do a couple things. But I mean, he he always had a decent running back in Cincinnati, and he had AJ Green. So it's like, yeah, you know I mean. That definitely inflated shit, but yeah, he but just looks terrible. He looked yeah. nasty work. He's a shell of himself. Bro. They was going to Justin Fields early in the game. Like, they was running like option packs. It was like, all right, once they start doing that, they start bringing the nigga They're in. They're too thirsty like, to bring game. you in. Yeah, it's, it's a dub. They, brought, Tra- they brought Trey Lance in, man, early in San Francisco. The right, that's a dub for Jimmy G. Like, I don't know why niggas still holding on to that one. Yeah. Your cousin Baker Mayfield came up just a little bit short yesterday. <laughs> Threw a nasty pick at the end. Yeah. I'm not gonna put it all on him. He had a good game. He, he, was okay. solid. he had a decent game. He was serviceable. He was once serviceable. Again. It was serviceable. It was a 300 yard game, but it was still serviceable. It was serviceable. It was serviceable. It was a nasty pick at the end. Like I, you might have should have took that sack for real. Like niggas really be nervous, b, when they play. Is that what Pat. it is? Ed, Pat, is Pat man, going back to the chip? He just might. My man Ed was at the game. I was like, yo, you cruising for a bruising, b, because he's a Browns fan. He went to Kansas City to watch the game. You know what I mean, yeah, one of them type niggas. Yeah. He like, yo, I, I hit him. I'm like, yo, you cruising for a bruising. He, he hit me. He like, yo, we up 15-3. Fuck out of here. Yeah, I man. checked back in. It was nasty Baker it pick. Was nasty Baker it was, pick. Uh, you know what I'm saying? Tyreek Hill did this and that. It was, you know what I'm saying? She took a turn for the worse. I'm like, bro, you going against Pat Mahomes. Like, he, he not about to just... Fucking lay it down, bro. I left the crib. I thought it was over for real. Like no, when them niggas was down twelve, over. I was like, you know what? I think Cleveland, because I'm like, it's a regular season. Cleveland might they just gonna run it out. Like this shouldn't be too hard. Like it's solid clock management. They should come out with the W. And then I came back and the crib was like a minute and a half left. And I'm like, these niggas got the ball back, and then it was over. Yeah, be <laughs> it was Patty over. M. Patty M is turning up, be. You know, Patty Patty M just need a little time to get warmed up. It's the very first game. You know what I'm saying? They just yeah. need a little little half first half to get get acclimated. You see my man. And Patty M gave you a bust down Cuban link chain you with the with the Dior the shirt. Nah, I missed I missed I missed post game. Oh, oh you Patty. missed post game Patty. Post game Patty. Post game Patty had a bust down. Yo, he had a. For I what? better. Didn't he just sign for five hundred? He just signed for five hundred. That's so the one. Have I three. never in my life seen Patty. He must have had his his handler say, "Yo, we gotta up your street cred." Like niggas ain't jacking you. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Because my that man might have been a PR move. Like, my man Pat Mahomes came out in a Dior white tee. And a and a and a bust and down and a, bu- and a bust down Cuban link chain. I said, "Oh, what the fuck is that, Pat Mahomes? He looked like Lamar Jack. Lamar Jack don't even be that blittery." I mean, yeah, he ain't get that second one yet. He yeah. ain't get that Patty Reed. Yeah, yet. I ain't seen Lamar Lamar Jack in the DRT. I'm pretty yet. sure if Lamar going. I'm sure Lamar going to get a re up because he did want an MVP. Like, yeah. this shit going to be nice. And he going to get extra never, icy. My son Dak don't give me no ice. He don't give me. He's so dry. He gets <laughs> minimal ice. He 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 sent money. You know I'm a Cowboys fan, but he donated to police. So you know where yeah. he stands. Where yeah. he's at with it. Like, like come on, man. You gonna uh, get, you gonna get put, the police more they money. They put my son James in a suit. You seen that? Jameis say, yo, I'm face of the team, be fuck out of here. I was just about to go on and Jay- talk about Jameis, man. Shout out to Jameis, man. Can we get an applause for Jameis? Let's fuck fuck with Jameis. We fucking with black Jameis, man. Redemption season. You know what I mean? For one, his name is Jameis. He's not anything other than black. You got to know that. Five touchdowns. First nigga to throw for five touchdowns in less than 150 yards. His so. name is definitely from slavery. That's what one. <laughs> Damn, slavery, Winston. <laughs> like, yeah, he do got a super nigga for his name. Winston, <laughs> don't get any blacker than that. Yeah, it's definitely slavery. But yeah, yeah I don't, I, I'm not going to get into the yardage. I don't know how that, how does that even happen? I don't happen? know, because it was like, they, was, they had I didn't watch the whole game. I ain't going to act like I watched it. And then they would throw it and then yeah. get a touchdown. I was just like, it's wild hey, fluky. James is here for you, B. Listen, I thought, I've been thought James was nice, because even though he threw 30 picks in Tampa Bay, the nigga did throw for 
for 5,000 yards and 30 touchdowns. So, yeah, like, I the knew game, the arm strength was there. The game plan called for Aaron, and, and it just, yo, if you throw, all right, look, if I throw 30 some touchdowns and I throw 5,000 yards and 30 picks, I'm going to say give or take 10, 15 of those picks to the receiver for. And the receivers have said that, like, niggas was like, yo, it wasn't even all on James. Like, a receiver might miss his route or some shit. Oh, yeah, I, niggas I, was I, supposed to fight for the ball. If you was a little better, you would have caught that. It would have been a touchdown. You on top of that, shit. Tampa Bay didn't have nearly the same old line that they have now that they yeah. gave time, and they didn't have the same running back situation yeah. or the weapons. Oh, you know yeah. what I mean? That, yeah, I mean, he still got it done. He didn't have Grock or Antonio Brown, and he still was giving these niggas air show. Yeah. I think with Sean Payton, he's going to be just fine. Yeah. Let's talk about the other side of the field. Aaron. Is he? Is, is he? I could, is Aaron the type of nigga to say, you know what? Fuck the Packers. I'm gonna just play like shit, and then this is gonna be it. Look, my man pulled up. <laughs> my man, oh, my man pulled up on me before the game. He had on a tour of Aaron Rodgers outfit. He's, uh-huh. a real, he's a real Milwaukee nigga, so he goes blood. He be wearing Giannis outfits and shit. Oh, okay. Like, the nigga, I'm like, yo. He like, yo. We about to da da Super Bowl, all this heavy shit. I'm like, yo. Aaron Rodgers' heart ain't in it, bro. Oh, you told him this was pre- before the game. Backers. Before the game, okay. I'm like, oh, his heart ain't in it, bro. I don't think his heart is in it, bro. Like to play football and be nice to be the quarterback to lead he the just team. Told niggas last year he's 50 50 on retired. Yeah, he, you gotta care. Like you really gotta care. You gotta want want it for this team. All that. Like you already gave the whole organization SMD vibes. You probably don't even know none of the niggas on your offense like that. Yep, like SMD. who the fuck are y'all niggas for real? Yeah, he's already like shown like he got other issues. Don't forget he was hosting Jeopardy, Jeopardy for a couple all weeks. All types like, of shit. You know what I'm saying? I think he's probably saying, you know, I don't have to get beat up. He's one for foot a out the door. B. He's already he's already made an announcement that he's not resigned. He's not. Re-signed Sign an extension and he's going somewhere else. Definitely next year. going somewhere else if, he if you play. If you announce that the year before before you even leave, before the season even start, bro, that means your heart is not in the season. That's bro. a fact. That's a fact. This is gonna be probably one of the worst years of his career. Damn, worst year? One of them. You know, I mean, it's probably it's Packers pretty, making the playoffs. Um mm. They in a such division, so it's possible, yeah. It's just one game. Because it's the... Yeah, they in a such division. The Vikings is, is dirt. trash. The Lions is dirt. Yeah, the Bears is dirt, yeah. The Lions might not be that bad. But, yeah, the... They're in a bullshit division, so they, they can definitely make, they can make the playoffs easily, you know what I'm saying? But it's just... Lions got smacked. Bears got smacked. <laughs> Did Minnesota win? Minnesota got strong offense. And Minnesota lost to the nasty Bengals. Yeah. He doesn't Joe Burrow and them niggas. Joe Burrow's nice. I like Joe Burrow. I want him but, to bubble. But, um... So basically, yeah, bro, I think the Packers... Yeah, it's, the it's, 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 <laughs> they're in the dirt division. It's a free fall, so they can definitely make the playoffs. Are they, the, are they worse than the NFC East? Yeah, that's what it's looking like. Yeah, because yeah. the Eagles aren't bad. The Eagles are going. The Eagles might make the playoffs. Cowboys is decent. They, they the, the, yeah, they, it's going to be between the Eagles and the Cowboys for that division. It look, yeah. looks like, as usual. Yeah, NFC North looking like the worst division of football at, at this yeah. rate. So if yeah, if A Rod might ca- can have really one of his worst seasons ever, and they and still, still can make, make the still back, yeah, he's gonna the, like ten and the, six. Yeah. Oh yeah, it's an extra game. We could go ten and seven. Yeah, yeah you I got you got to think. Oh, a mediocre season for A Rod is still pretty good. Still you know pretty mean? good, exactly. So, like, he could definitely make the playoffs with a mediocre. Like, he just got what you gotta do is just beat up on the divisional opponents. Just yeah. beat up on them bum ass niggas. Yeah, and they'll be all right. Yeah, who you got? Who you got tonight? Monday Night Football. Who Lamar playing? versus Derek Carr. Raiders and Ravens. Uh, damn. I mean, uh, Lamar probably gonna show out, but Raiders gonna win. B. Damn. Baltimore's trash. B. They they're done for now. Okay. So they need, a, they need a they need it they need to have a bad season and get a good draft. And B. Yeah. I, I'm gonna still pick the Ravens. I don't really believe um John Gruden and his that in his situation yet. Damn, you don't believe Gruden? He has Shut the face on Monday yeah, night. Nah. You know they you know the power that B is gonna buff John Gruden. They man. are. They can't wait. They, they can't, can't wait. give you all the stats, <laughs> all the miscellaneous stats, but, but forget to tell you that he hasn't had a winning season to how long. You know what I mean? And he still got a 10-year deal out the gate, which was crazy. But uh, yeah, uh I'm just most the biggest takeaway from week one for me is Dak and the Cowboys. I like what they did. You know, I'm a Cowboys fan, so even though we lost, and I'm not big on moral victories, that was a moral victory. We lost to the champs. They, they, they I feel like their defense was better and their offense is better, and we still showed up. We was right there with them. The niggas flat out just spent the whole preseason line, and niggas talking about how hurt this nigga was and all this. Yeah, he didn't look hurt at all. Shit, he didn't all look this, hurt at all. This nigga, they threw the ball damn near 60 times. Yeah, it was just an air show. They didn't right. even give it. We could have gave Zeke vibe, some more touches. Oh, they, they on hard knocks talking about Zeke in best shape of his life. He about did to look feed thinner. Him. He uh, did look uh, thinner. Yo, they flat out barely gave Zeke the ball. They, the niggas was it. like, niggas, uh, niggas thought that um they forgot Zeke in the offensive plan. 
Like, like niggas for, forgot him in the game plan. Yeah, for they real, clearly for forgot him in the game plan. <laughs> like, niggas was like, yeah, damn, yeah. can a nigga catch a screen pass it's or something? something. Y'all, y'all like giving the Pollard nigga the ball OD. Like, what the fuck, son? Name is like, going Pollard crazy. Yeah, it don't make no sense to pay the man and don't give him the box, son. But yeah, man, but, um, and I cooked you in fantasy, so don't think, don't think I forgot about that week one. Don't worry about yeah, it. Whatever. It's, it's, it's early. It's early. Cappy, cappy. But, um, early. You got a you got a couple couple lucky niggas that went crazy. Yeah, Tom was, was the key. The 49ers defense showed up for me too. Yeah, it's ridiculous. I, I mean, but they, I don't know why niggas left. They got the bosses. Like you know, niggas get busy over there. They got the bosses. <laughs> <laughs> they got some active white boys. Like niggas don't get busy. You shit me. What the fuck is you talking about? Let's get into our favorite segment, man. You already know what it is. You want to start? Well, I'll start because we since we're on the topic, I'm all set on Aaron Rodgers because I'm in a fantasy league and I have the tight end who plays for the Packers. That means he's a guy that Aaron Rodgers has to throw to. And because, like Rich was saying, he doesn't have his heart in it, I don't think he's going to be throwing to my nigga that much. <laughs> I don't think he's going to get any type of points or touches. So, yeah, yeah that's what I'm all set on for the week until further. It might be fucking ugly. Um, I'm all set. Yo, I'm all set on... The um the transgender MMA fighter nigga that was fighting in the women's league and beat the joint up this with the, over the weekend. <laughs> like we got like we gotta stop the madness, be like you sick of it. <laughs> like come on, son. Like some was well diesel, son. Like come on, be like yeah. the nigga would have been diesel by any standard. By any standards, right? Woman, man, anybody. You feel me? I'm like come on, be. This is ridiculous. But you gonna tell me this nigga's a joint? You know what I'm saying? He's fighting against joints. Ridiculous, yeah, definitely baby. fighting against joints. When a when a when a joint get killed in the ring one That's time, that's when y'all better, y'all better keep that same energy too. Like, cause I don't understand, like, how is this what we fighting for? How we fighting for rights to niggas that want to go in the ring and beat on joints, like? <laughs> and tell you, nah, I'm a joint too, bro. Yo, did, you seen the weightlifting trish, <laughs> weightlifting trendy, <laughs> and it, he's so mm-hmm. trash that he still didn't win. Like, you did all of that. You, he was a weightlifter for the niggas. Couldn't qualify for. Shit, you know what I mean? Said, fuck it, I'm gonna see if I can change to a vagina. And then you still got to the Olympics and still ain't win. Like, yeah, my nigga, yeah. how you lose against the joints? This shit is so fucking spooky. Like, it's spooky out here. Like, they need to have, they gotta create their own leagues or something, cause that shit not right, bro. Nah, and ain't nah. somebody's gonna get hurt badly, son. Badly. It's cause somebody's gonna be act, like built, gonna be built like Arnold and be like, you know what, fuck it, I'm gonna just give me the snip and I'm going over with the bitches. And he's gonna do yeah. real damage. Yeah. Real damage. That shit is spooky, man. But um, yeah, man, we here. We appreciate y'all. Yo, you got a herb? You know, you're supposed to do like a, a herb of the week, a herb of the get nigga set. You got you got you got a, a vitamin you want to promote mm. <laughs> for the people? Uh, turmeric. Turmeric. Get your turmeric, man. Google it so you can find out what it does. It does everything for you. Get you right. Facts. You know what I mean? Make sure I take your turmeric shots with your ginger shots. Make sure your body's all set. And we'll be in. We'll be in touch next week. Same time. Nigga, look out for us, man. Subscribe. We appreciate y'all. Make sure y'all go on Apple Podcasts, leave a review. Submit. Uh, we like the uh response from the polls we've been getting. We're gonna keep that going. We see y'all like that. Stop asking us to do husband and men. We're not rating no niggas. We're not bro. rating niggas, bro. Y'all can do your own show and rating your own niggas. We're not that's doing what, no we're niggas, not bro. doing that. But we'll keep the poll. Wednesday to Friday is poll days. Holler at us. <clears throat> yeah, bro. Clip this shit. I was fucking...